welcome to our short video on getting started with QDOS. The first thing you're going to want to do is register, which is free, so click on the menu item and click sign up free and fill in the simple registration form. We'd recommend that you opt in to the updates where we can send you updates about how your work is performing and about general functionality on QDOS. Also, it's a good time to include your institution name. The next step is adding your articles to QDOS. So once you've registered, you'll go through to your QDOS hub and any articles already included will be listed. But if there's nothing there, you can click on add publication. There are three ways you can add your articles to QDOS. If you know the DOI for your publication, you can enter that. Or you could search for some keywords from your publication title or add your last name in there as well. Finally, if you have an ORCID account, you can import your list of publications from ORCID straight into QDOS. Now we're ready to create your story page, including your plain language summary. There are two key things we're going to add to this page, the what's it about and a featured image. So we'll start with what's it about. So the what's it about box is where we're looking for a simple, non-technical, plain language summary of your work. And we give some examples of what we're looking for. So you just type in the box and click save. Then you're going to scroll down to the image section and you're going to type in a keyword into the box there and search our image library of millions of rights free beautiful images. And I would suggest you just type in a single search term uh, and find something that looks really stunning and is going to make your article really stand out. So I'll show you a different example here where I've already added a what's it about and a featured image as well. And then click on the switch to reader view toggle at the top right to see how your page looks and then you can click edit page to switch back and edit it and keep making changes until you're happy. Next up is sharing your story. So from the edit page, scroll down to the share section and here you can create trackable links which you can give a label to each one. So I'm gonna use an example here of a link I'll include in my email signature file. So type in your label, generate the link and then you can copy that and paste that either in your email signatures, on blog posts, on social media, on posters, wherever you want to include that. And because each link is individual and trackable, you can see which of your sharing activities is generating the best results. And the final stage is checking your metrics. So from your hub, you can click on the metrics button, or if you've gone through to the edit page for your articles, you can click on publication metrics. And that will take you to a metrics overview where you can see how many shares you've made, how many clicks you've had on those shares, how many views on QDOS, the alt metric score, and other metrics that you may be interested in. So that's a very quick guide to getting started with QDOS. Register for free, add your articles either by adding the DOI, searching for your article, or importing through ORCID. Create your story page and add a what's it about and a featured image. Share your story on lots of channels using our trackable links, and then check your metrics to see how your article is performing. Thank you for watching.